I just wanted, there we go. Okay, so I just wanted to show you um, how to redeem coupons and see where to get them. So I logged into my Tupperware account. I'm going to go into my sales. This takes a minute to load. When going into my sales, this is here where you're going to see the uh, your personal summary. This is how much sales that you made a month. Um, and just these numbers here, you can just, um, it's essentially uh, how many parties that you have booked. So I know that like, I have one then. Um, I will be having one here for sure. Or actually, I think I should be having two there. And I'll just save that for next. Update now. There we go. Anyway, just this is just the main screen when you go into My Sales, it shows you. Um, in order to look at coupons, you want to select Resources, My Coupons. As you guys can see, down below my Redeem Coupons. Oh, yes, I have a few. Um, and I have a couple here that I need to redeem, and it's My Unused Coupons. So here you will see your coupons that you need to redeem if you have any. How to do it is you go into Salesforce. I'm sorry, Party History from here. And you can see my parties and stuff that I have since December. So that doesn't include all the other ones I have. So you select Start New Party. Now, like if you're just redeeming like the coupons, you can do Non-Party. Or you can add it to a party, like if you're hosting a party or you have a bunch of sales, just add it to that. Uh, normally when you spend, like when it's over $100 in orders, you won't get charged for additional um, shipping. If it's under $100, you definitely want to do it in a non-party. So here when I go non-party, it's going to ask for descriptions. So I'm just going to say coupons. And you want to select party date. So I'll just put today's date. See here it has uh, all my information. It says primary ship to. So I just have it shipped to myself. And I select next. And as that loads, I'm just if you can choose a customer if you're putting in customer's information, you want to make sure I selected that. However, I'm not, it's going to be me. So I'm just going to select consultant tab. And it just copies all my information over. And I select next. So here in this screen, you guys will see my coupons that I want to redeem. So what I do is I just I select it. It gives me this warning, but just gives me the information. Let me know when it was um, expires. Um, it just gives all the details that uh, you know they put in there and expires 30 days of re receiving it, I guess. Um, so I'm gonna when I have it highlighted, I'm gonna select redeem my coupon. So when I select redeem my coupon, it gives me the number here. So I'm just gonna click on the coupon number. And when I did click on it, it came up down here. And I'll click on it again for my other coupon. I'm going to close out the window. Now if I scroll down, I select Verify. And um, as you can see, it uh, came through. I did get an award for Serving Center, so that's free. That's not going to cost me anything. Um, the award uh, that you get for signing up is the Impression Bowl set, so it's going to cost you $12. Cost isn't $24, it's more than that. Um, anyways, so then you can go next. I Just one more thing before I end this video for you guys to look at. I did also want it to let you know how to search for items, especially if you're doing samples, which I love samples. I select Item Search. Here is a great searching tool that will help you guys out. What I do for searching samples, I select the samples tab and I click search. Here we'll give you all the samples that are available and there's the cost price that you guys can see. 
and you just scroll through and there's all kinds of lists like this is the fundraiser you can even redeem the fundraiser um, stuff that's on samples as well there's all kinds of great stuff here for such a sweet price um, totally recommend to take a look at it see if there's anything interesting that you guys like and you just select what you want I'm just gonna do um, what should I do? There, okay, I'm gonna do the stock cooker just for example. Because it's 139 retail, but you'd be getting it for ninety dollars. Verify. See I just wanted to show you this because this is what you're paying is right here at the cost. So you just want to ignore this and ignore this. So I'm going to select next. So here's going to show you the breakdown, right? And where you don't see anything here and it looks confusing. So what I learned is you select show consultant details. So that's going to give you a better understanding. So here is the... Uh, more of a better breakdown that sometimes helps uh, explain things a little bit more. Samples ninety dollars. Sales aid is twenty four dollars, which I would just ignore that here. One fourteen. Oh, sorry. The reason why it's twenty four dollars, my bad, is because I have two coupons to redeem for that. That's why the total is twenty four. So that's right. So then it lets you know my Product sub totals 114. Shipping and handling is three. Now, guess why I wanted to choose a sample to show you that you are getting paid the sample price, even though it doesn't look like it right here. So always use the uh, consulting details. That'll help you out, so you're not confused. Because I was confused so much. So once I'm done. It says pending. I just go to party summary. And it's thinking and loading and whatnot. But here is your party summary. So here we'll give you all the information that you need. You can always click on this or go back. Or you can close out of this if you want and go back into it later. It doesn't mean that it's finalized. Here shows you your coupons redeemed. Um, and then it has here what the grand total is going to be. So even though it says shipping and handling three ninety five, dollars um, the party shipping and handling was actually a total of four seventeen. dollars um, So the total balance due is $143. And uh, that total balance will be coming out of like my pocket, so you can choose. Um, a new card if you wanted to do a credit card or whatnot. I do have uh, an existing, I did get the Tupperware card, so I use that a lot of the times. Um, anyways, I hope this information was helpful, and uh, you guys have a good evening or day. Bye-bye. If I can stop this. Oh, and if you did find this useful, just let me know because I may purchase this program to do better and improved videos. <laughs> Thanks.